Intrinsic interest rate of trade credit. Calculate the benefit of taking early payment terms on trade credit. Pay Me Early Inc. has sold widgets to BuyerCorp. They have agreed to trade credit terms of 110 net 30. You represent BuyerCorp and have been given the task of determining whether it makes sense to use credit from your bank to make early payment on your payables to Pay Me Early Inc. So we, our job is to calculate the APR intrinsic to the credit terms and the EAR intrinsic to them. So first of all, we need to interpret the meaning of 110 net 30. Basically means pay within 10 days in order to get a 1% discount, otherwise pay within 30 days. Let's compare the two options on the timeline. So paying within 30 days simply means pay a certain number. Now I'm just going to use 100 for simplicity and I'm showing it as a minus because it's paying out 100 in 30 days. The other option is paying within 10 days and against a discount of one means we would be paying 99 in 10 days. So which financing would equate the two in terms of value? Let's take the early payment option of 99 in 10 days. So imagine that uh, someone's financing us. The bank would be paying us 99 in 10 days, and then we would pay the bank back 130 days. So the question is, if that financing is, uh, would, if the bank would finance us for less than the intrinsic rate involved in that, so let's equate those two options. What is the intrinsic late rate in that financing? And can we get cheaper financing than the, in, that inherent in the 99 in 10 days versus the 100 in 30 days? So the return is simply the $1 or the one divided by the 99, which is the initial amount. So that's 1.0101%. So that's the return that we are going to get. And the period for that return is 30 minus 10 days or 20 days that this uh, return is being financed in. So to calculate the APR and the EAR, we need to calculate this, the number of periods for one year to annualize it. And the number of periods is based on the days. We have 365 days divided by 20 days for this period. So we're looking at 18.25 periods a year. So the APR is simply the period return times the number of periods in a year. That gives us a grand total of 18.43%. And the EAR, that's using a power law, of course, because of the compounding effect. And that's going to give us a result of 20.13%. So that's a very good return for paying um, early. And essentially, if the company has enough liquidity at hand and the financing costs are less than 20.13%, it makes sense, of course, to pay the early point in 10 days and take the 1% discount. So that's it, and thanks for your attention. Hope that helped.